So this is what the, the wound looks like now. Um, thankfully, uh, I think she's managing without antibiotics. I've been in touch with the vet, so we're keeping an eye on it. Um, the deep tissue swelling and everything uh, is gone, and it's mainly like a hard, hardened um, area on the skin. Um, I've put some magnesium sulfate on it again a couple of times. And I've squeezed it, um, but there isn't really anything much coming out. I think it's just the, the skin now needs to recover. Her leg is not quite so flaccid anymore underneath. And uh, the other thing that I didn't realise that the vet told me was um, that um, some ticks um, seem to carry some weird bacteria that don't actually um, get the um, white blood cells activated, uh, the lymphocytes, um, and uh, I suppose the, I don't know whether it's the lymphocytes and the leukocytes, and um, so the pus doesn't actually look like white pus, um, but it looks more like crystallised honey, and that was exactly what I saw on the first day, um, so uh, the tick that she had must have carried some of these very weird bacteria. But hopefully we're on the way to recovery now. She's generally happier to move and I can touch it a bit more. And she did let me squeeze it even though she didn't like it. So uh, hopefully we'll, we'll be okay.